I guess I'm a physio and fit as a physio. These are some taping techniques I use to prevent and treat injuries. Effectively, your patellar tendon gets irritated at the inferior pole of your patella. So you're yeah, putting a force straight across the middle of the tendon. He's almost trying to bring the pressure, the count force, into the into the middle of the tendon. Like a tennis elbow strap, we wouldn't strap right over the lapi, lateral epicondyle, we'd bring it down into the forearm. So, same thing, you're going through the middle of the tendon, trying to bring that irritation away from the inferior pole. So generally I'll do just a little anchor halfway around. Try not to crease the tape. And again, you can either use this with rigid or you can use it with probably better sometimes with the elastic 25. Make yourself a little patella tendon rope almost. And then that's going through the middle of his tendon, you know, touching back on. And I might do that two or three times. You're trying to deform the tendon, you're trying to deviate, just, just change, change the angle of pull. Pull. Just drop it into the middle of the tendon rather than the, at the attachment. So maybe you're unloading the sore fibres and loading up some other fibres. Yep. So I might do that two, three times. Either overload, uh, over wrap it with some rigid or uh, or wrap it again with some 50 or 25. So there are some patella tendon straps like jumpers and air straps with a silicon pad. Velcro straps that people put on. So, But I get people to squat, jump, pre-taping, put the tape on, it should make a difference. If it doesn't then you need to either go tighter or, you, or change your angle slightly.